Okay, quiet down. I'm changing my lesson for today. Instead of a regular class, we'll be reviewing last week's materials. I suggest you listen carefully. But don't think you can slack off, okay? I absolutely won't allow it. No slacking off. Hmm. Weird. Hmm. She's going totally against the curriculum. All that stuff about slacking off was a little odd too. Wait a second. Is this what you meant by ditch class? I would have thought she'd let you leave the room or something, but I guess you can't really complain. Slacking off in Kawakami's class. With Kawakami's help, you will be able to slack off in class on certain days. Use this free time to do various things such as reading or crafting infiltration tools. However, you will gain knowledge by choosing to study instead. Please keep this trade-off in mind. Kawakami's been kind enough to give us this free time, so we'd better put it to good use. What do you want to do? So, what's the plan? We'll read. Um, we will... Hmm... Comprehensive guide on increasing emotional depth on camera. Sure, that sounds fun. That's not. <laughs> it's not very uh, discreet, is it? Films will seem more enjoyable once you understand mise en scene. Scene? Scene? I don't know. Yeah. M mise? What? Is this a French term or something? Yes. Oh. So you finished reading Craft of Cinema. Mise en scène. I thought film was all about story, but I guess every visual detail on the screen means something. This triggered a whole new perspective for me. I'm ready to watch all kinds of movies and DVDs now. All right. You now understand how to deeply enjoy the art, uh, the art of film and DVD. From this point forward, watching movies and DVDs has a greater impact on you. Well, it's a little late, but sure. Hmm. Ah, that was great. We should thank Kawakami for this later. You think the Phantom Thieves are freaking out? I wrote Okamura too. I hope they'll handle it quickly. He's really corrupt. If anyone needs a change of heart, it's him. The board of directors is putting pressure on the vice principal. There's something seriously wrong with the vice principal. Hey, what's Akechi up to? He isn't hiding now that everyone turned against him. Public... Public opinion has truly flipped between him and us, but I doubt he's given up. And if we don't hurry, the public will turn against us next. There are already signs of that. And let's move. We can't go wasting our popularity. I'd like to stop my father as well, for everyone's sake. Considering Harry's circumstances, we must follow through with this. Oh. Immediate improvement again? Sure. At the nurse's office. Well, shall we begin? Let's get started. For today's topic, let's see. I'd like to hear your opinion on these Phantom Thieves of Hearts. The ones who steal the desires of criminals and reportedly force them to confess. Maybe it's a little hard to believe, but I guess I've taken an academic interest in them. Mm, you really are dedicated. <laughs> I don't know about that. It's just a gut feeling I have. But I get the feeling the Phantom Thieves' work and my own research are rooted in the same principles. That's why I've decided to analyze them from my own perspective. For example, there's the matter of their methods. According to those calling cards they send out, their stated method is to steal your desires. How is such a feat even possible? Any ideas? How about you, Maruki? <laughs> a question for a question, huh? That's unusual for you, but let's see. I suppose it would be possible if there was some material proxy for those desires. Say. Hmm, do you remember that story with the cookies? In that experiment, the desire for the cookies actually changed the way people tasted them. I think we can look at this in the same way. They're not something easily perceived, but desires have a tremendous effect on our cognition. Put another way, if that desire is gone, your cognitive perception of the cookie skews back to normal. So, does that remind you of anything? The change of heart? Right. That's right. The Phantom Thieves' own change of heart. That's the basis of my theory. 
Their theft of desire is not metaphorical, but something more direct. We still don't know exactly how they steal these desires, of course. But if this idea of physical, tangible desires can be actualized, I think it would logically follow that they can be taken away. In a world of intangibles, let's say a world composed of the contents of people's hearts. Well, they're thieves, so if they could perceive a world like that, they could steal desires like any other treasure. Hey, you think I'm getting anywhere here? Hmm, it's intriguing. You think so too? If it's actually anywhere close to the truth, it would be incredible. Then again, we'll probably never know for sure unless we could ask one of the Phantom Thieves themselves. Hmm, I think I can construct a solid hypothesis now. It feels like I'm just one step away from finishing this paper. Thank you. Heartfelt gratitude. Rank 7. Raises the chance of flow succeeding. Okay. Alright. Now, today's mental training technique. How about something like this? Thanks to Maroki's mental training, my mind feels stronger. Right. Oh, and here. Never a bad time for a snack, right? Phantom wafers. Okay. Well, see you. I hope we can chat again sometime. Yo. Another box came for you. Hey! Did you get our stuff from the dark web? Oh yeah. You bought some stuff from Shady Commodities. I did indeed. Let's buy some more. Hehehe. <laughs> Oops. Uh wrong key. Welcome, this is Tanaka's Shady Commodities. Mr. Joker, you've opened the door to possibilities that normal people can only dream of. Now you can find all the rare items you could possibly want. Okay, that's more. I still have these, but now I also have this and a black robe. Oh, you won't use it, but it's only 500 yen. A blast Megatama and a Godly Megatama. I think that should be enough for now. Do we need more of that? Probably not. Um, we'll buy that too. So far, you've spent a total of 57,500 yen. Good news, Mr. Joker. You've spent over 50,000 yen. Your member rank is now dark. Now we can purchase all of our dark tier products. Your order will arrive soon. We understand your excitement, but we ask for your patience. We hope to see you again soon. Alright, and who wants something from us? Um... You know what? Sure. Let's call her. Oh, master! This is Becky. Oh, hold on, it's you. Uh, by the way, is your house ever going to get air conditioning? Made outfits get too hot during summer and really cold in winter. They're so impractical. Oh well. As long as you request me, I'll do your housework for just five thousand yen. It won't deepen just yet, but sure. Come over. Then I'll head over. Okay, I'll get dropped off from the store then. Please clean up your room and wait for me. It's your job. She seems to be thankful that I requested her, and it'll grow stronger soon. Very nice. Thank you for using our service. All right, more bonds. Ah, we were able to grab a seat. Why don't you read something until we get there? Uh, absolutely. Hmm. Sure, let's read Theme Park Escort. Hmm? Enjoy a world of dreams filled with popular attractions. Man. Destiny Land in my hammer, huh? It's a hugely popular spot that's great for families and even going on dates. I could never go there by myself, though. You have to invite someone or it'd just be too lonely. Oh, well, I guess we will invite someone. Oh. 
So you finished reading Theme Park Escort. Now I'm really interested in Destiny Land and my Hama. On the red line. My Hama. A famous resort not far from Tokyo. Everyone wants to go to Destiny Land. The land of dreams. My Hama was named after Miami Beach. Its hotels make for a breezy stay. Alright. You should invite someone to go there with you sometime. Oh, don't go without me. Oh, we're almost at the station. I said I was an efficient use of your time. Maybe. Now everyone. Autumn is for eating. Autumn is for art. Autumn is for reading. Stores will use whatever reasons they can to pull in customers. This season in particular. Ah, yes. People also say that autumn is for sports. A while back, baseball was the national sport, but these days people have been into soccer. As you know, black and white are the common colors for soccer balls. Now then, could you take a look at this picture? I can. Do you know this one? How many white and black shapes are there respectively on a soccer ball? Okay. Ah, uh, let me think about this. Well, it definitely varies, because you can make a soccer ball that's not black and white, uh, obviously. You know what? I'm just going to say that, because if that's wrong, then they are wrong. Hmm. No. You are wrong. It isn't incorrect, because soccer balls aren't always black and white. This ball is composed of 12 black pentagons and 20 white hexagons. Yeah, this one maybe, but not all footballs. That makes a total of 32 surfaces. By the way, apparently soccer balls used to be only one color. They changed it to black and white so it could be seen better on television, or so I hear anyway. Television was still in black and white when they started airing soccer in Europe. At any rate, the contrast of white and black next to each other, it's a slick design, don't you think? Yeah, yeah, whatever. A recent design that's caught my eye is the Moon Burger, which uses an egg to represent the moon. I'm well aware of the bad rumors surrounding Okamura foods, but you can't argue with hunger. Mm. You think someone like her really eats hamburgers? Maybe. I don't know. Hey. Shouldn't you tell the others about the target momentous? Maybe. Who wants to talk? Oh even more absolutely wants to ask something about his paper let's go see welcome it's already awesome you'd expect it to get a little less hot huh no oh, do you maybe have time today if you wouldn't mind can i borrow you for a chat i've got snacks too okay bond won't hmm. beep just yet Ah, yeah, whatever let's do it anyway Someone. yep Marcus seems full of energy. It seems like his paper is coming along well. And the bond will grow stronger soon. Well, see you. All right. Ah, you're back. There haven't been any mental shutdown cases lately, right? Not since Okamura took first place in a ranking. Perhaps the culprit behind them is being cautious due to the success we've had recently. So it's because of us. Damn, I'm glad we're famous. But it's highly probable they become active again. Especially if they think the Phantom Thieves aren't actively attempting to do anything. We're also going to be in trouble if we let public opinion go down the path it's heading. Yes, there have been a great deal more instigating comments lately, and we're all trying so hard. Our inactivity must be upsetting. We should keep that in mind. Alright, uh, let's see. Oh, Akichi. He's in Kichi Joji. Sure. Hi. Hey, good evening. Hey. I have some time before the shoot. If you're not busy, do you want to hang out? Yes. What do you want to do? Thank you. Good, then let's get going. Alright, it seems he's made a discovery for our discussion. 
Okay, give him a gift. Something useful. Hmm. Mm. <laughs> well, fountain pen is definitely what's meant as his gift. This is for me. Thanks. It feels like I touched Akichi's heart a little. Okay, we'll grow stronger soon. Very good. Bye. Well, see you. at this hour you have tomorrow off right I'm gonna be in standby at the hideout so we gotta play games I'll bring an awesome one tomorrow I'll show you the rope so you can use it to let out your stress but what if you're busy then do that first oh wait it's a retro game called power intuition look forward to it time to make like a tree you should get some sleep if Futaba's going to be here during the day tomorrow Who needs police when we have the Phantom Thieves? So true. So much for being a great detective. Ak Akichi is finished. I'm really curious about their true identities. Those calling card posters are collector's items now. Hey. There's 16 days left. Are you going to send the calling card? Wait, Futaba's down here in the shop. It sounds like Futaba's here. Wow. Yeah. Home shopping program is airing today as well. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, calming aromas. Oh, five lockpicks. Yep, we're definitely buying that. Phantom Waver's calling postcards. Okay, you know what? Hey. Buy this. Oh, another buyer's just calling. Yes, I have. All right, oops, did oh. I click on it again? Yep, yeah, okay. Ptaba, hello. Yo. I'm gonna hang out here today, so I brought a little, pre a, a pretty ancient game to kill time. It's power intuition, a real controller busting bomb muncher. You have the courage to meet me in a test of metal? Sure. Hey, hey. Come on, let's ditch the infiltration and kick back with some games today. Right. Sure. Heck yeah, come on, let's go. Looks kind of worn out, but I think it should still work. Okay, okay, game start. All right. Here it goes. I'm so pumped. Hmm. I should try my best, indeed. Huh? What? A block into low punch combo? Was that intentional? Dang, you're good. Come on, it's the final round. Let's do it. This is the moment of truth. Use uh, directional arrows to match the arrows on screen within the time limit. Then press uh, Enter to complete the command. I can't believe you actually read my air combo. Are you some kind of god or something? I'm not going to let you quit when you're ahead. This next round is totally going to be mine. I played games with Futaba until she was fully satisfied. It feels like I gained the guts to face strong foes. Very nice. That was fun. Games are the ultimate form of entertainment. Hey. I wish I could hang a little longer. Do you have stuff to do after this? Uh, want me to make curry? Hmm. Curry, huh? Nah, I'm not feeling it tonight. Do you have stuff to do after this? Okay. Want some coffee? Really? I'm glad I asked. <laughs> Gotta love coffee. The smell alone is enough to kick the sleepies in the butt. Okay. Yep, yep. Hey, barista. The suit look. The the look suits you. Okay. Tava's gaze is intense. She seems to have high expectations. <laughs> Put some love into it. Oh. Such skills. When did you level up? <laughs> you, you tricked me. It's so strong. I'm shocked. It's her coffee. 
This is what adults like to drink, right? So one day I'll think it's delicious too. I don't know, couldn't tell you. We drank coffee and enjoyed a leisurely conversation. Bye now. Oh, look at the time. See you tomorrow. Thank you so much. Mm, what are you talking about? I'm sorry, I'm just so happy. I just got out of that meet I was talking to you about and my routine was the best I've ever given so far. So I just wanted to thank you for that. I didn't do anything. You're the reason I've come so far. You helped me so much even with the mundane things. I just can't thank you enough. Oops, please, I just want to thank you again. As soon as I get the results, I'll let you know. So I'll be messaging you again sometime soon. Now I'd better get going. Have a good night. Good morning. That reminds me. Hey, have you decided what you're doing with the calling card? When will you send it? Let's send it today, sure. I understand. It's a good plan. We should act quickly for Haru's sake, too. Well, let's get everyone together. I'll be waiting at the hideout. Oh yeah, we said we'd meet at the hideout. Let's head there now. All right. Thanks for inviting me. Oh, I'm the first one here. Yep, you've got them all beat. I see. Actually, this may have been a stroke of good luck. There's something that I want to discuss with you. Discuss? Mm -hmm. What's the situation? I've been thinking. I want to be more helpful to the Phantom Thieves. So I came up with a new approach to fighting in hopes of making it a regular strategy in our battles. But I need your help to make it happen, Monachan. Oh, <laughs> me, eh? Well, if you need me, then who am I to turn you down? Thank you. So, I'll get right to it. What I'm thinking is... And that's how we finish. Haru? Sometimes the stuff you come up with honestly scares me. Oh, it's absolutely fine if you don't want to. Not another word. I'll do it. You deserve only the grandest of performances. Great. Thank you, Mona-chan. I wonder if the star will grant us our wish. All right. Morgan and Haru's showtime has been unlocked. Just you wait, leader. I'll show you my best. Oh yeah, I nearly forgot because of how good Haru is at fighting. But she's new to the team, right? Shouldn't we do what we did for Yusuke and Makoto? Ah, you mean the Phantom Thief basic training. There's much we need to teach her. Please do. Oh, someone's excited. Then again, I already told her the gist of things. What other stuff should we talk about? Oh, about how we defeated my fiancé in there. Will that have any effect on my father? Nope. They did something similar in my palace, but I'm perfectly fine. Uh, is that so? But man, that cognitive person stuff is crazy. He was so similar that even Haru couldn't tell. That might have just been a coincidence. Usually, cognitive people look totally different. The version of me in Kamoshida's castle was terrible. Uh. And the version of me at the museum was a painting, not even a person. Now that you mention it, why isn't there a cognitive version of me? Is it somewhere in there? Ah, uh, he does not care about you in the slightest. Well, I could imagine a couple of reasons why we haven't seen it, but I don't think you'd like them. Nope. <sighs> Come on. Or she's don't locked up in a cell somewhere. Stuff. Anyways. If a dude's cognition can change the scenery or even the people in the palace, couldn't you use that to make a dream world filled with places and people you love? Man, palaces are super promising. My greatest hopes and dreams might still come true. Well, that's kind of impossible this time. <laughs> but maybe we should try in the future. That sounds fun, sure. <sighs> in any case, if Haru followed that conversation, there's nothing else we need to teach her. All right, send the calling card. All right, let's do this. We will entrust this to you, Haru. OK, 
Okay. I place this in my father's study, and the treasure will appear, correct? If he notices the calling card, then yes. Are you afraid of doing this to your own father? To be honest, a little. Try to recall your anger. It will guide you in the right direction. So we're carrying out this plan tomorrow? That's right. All right. No staying up late tonight, then. We can laugh or cry all we want, but we only get one shot at this. Everyone, I'm counting on you. Hey. A little box came for you. Huh? Nice. Oh, both boxes arrive. Okay, uh, now I actually need to check. I forgot about that earlier. I need to check the equipments. Uh, oh, the ghillie vest is real good. Repel physical med. Military fatigues that aid in survival skills. All right. And I guess that also means I can give Yuskid a royal holy shroud. And Ryuji can... Oh, I have another one? Sure. Ryuji can have that one. Um... Then, uh, Makoto. Little devil undershirt. A seductive undershirt, okay. There you go. And Haru, maybe? Okay, the spacesuit is already pretty good. Futaba can have the old row. I guess it's not much of a difference. I'd actually rather have the evasion, to be honest. Uh, what about Anne? Yeah, that's good enough. Organa can have the shocking scarf. Did I miss anyone? I think I looked at everyone. Alright. Then... What movie have I rented out? Uh, Guts. Okay, you know what? We'll watch that. story about an editor trying to rush a struggling writer to meet his deadline with very over-the-top music. <sighs> that editor is terrifying. No one could finish that many pages in such a short time. Does he even stand a chance? Yep. That writer was given an impossible task, but he kept on writing until his fingers bled. Maybe you've learned a thing or two about guts from watching this drama. Thanks to the craft of cinema, I was able to enjoy the show on a deeper <laughs> level. Okay, and I think when I finish the movie, or the show, I'll be able to Whoa. max guts. Hopefully. Sir Kunikazu Okumura, the great profiteering sinner of greed. Your success and global fame exists due to the tyranny you reign over your employees. Thus, we have decided to make you confess all your crimes with your own mouth. Hmm. From the Phantom Thieves. I must take care of this before it becomes a problem. I've received a calling card from the Phantom Thieves. I need you to send it over to the police. Don't make me repeat myself. Give it to the police. That's an order. These scoundrels have threatened me. Aren't the police supposed to side with law-abiding citizens? I will not fail. This matter is urgent. Take care of it at once. I need to let everyone know about this. Wow! What's that smell? Did you get a new perfume? It's nice. Yeah, it's a new fall fragrance. It's supposed to be mysterious like the Phantom Thieves. I thought I'd wear it to show my support while they're out there taking down an evil corporation. Show support, huh? I could post a photo online of all the fan merch I've amassed. Maybe they'll be motivated by how passionate their fans are. Wait, he even figured out when we're gonna do it? 
This is different from normal. He has some nerve delivering the calling card to the police himself. Either he's certain his heart won't be changed, or he's colluded with the police from the beginning. As strange as it is for me to say, I could see that being the case. Whoa, the comments are coming in hot. Look! Take him down, Phantom Thieves. I don't care what the Phantom Thieves do as long as they show up, haha. -ha. Just do it quick, lol. <laughs> They're just saying whatever they want. At this point, all they care about is seeing those in power beg for forgiveness. Damn it, this isn't a game! The means and the ends have been reversed. We're starting to be seen purely as entertainment. But we gotta do this! We can't just drop everything now! Considering the existence of the palace, his desires are indeed distorted. In a sense, the earlier we pull the root, the better. And given the issue concerning Haru's fiance, we don't have another choice in the matter. If we don't, then everything we've been doing up until now would just be for nothing. I believe this is best too. After hearing my father speak, I saw no remorse in him. Ryuji and Haru are right. But Okumura Oops. may just be the one. Honestly, everything the public is talking about does bother me a little. I'm behind the mental collapses. We can't leave this be. You most definitely can't. I feel like he's hiding something. Something big. True. And we already sent the calling card after all. Let's do this like we always do. And steal his palace's treasure. Yep, we'll do that. All right. Who do we currently have in the party? Not the personas. Uh, stats. We've got Yusuke, Makoto, and Haru. Um, let me just see. Can I see your skills somewhere? Yeah. She's just got Sai, pretty much. Mm, it's not amazing. Oops, uh, Makoto has, yeah, she's got just Nuke, I guess, and she's got Wind, but we can cover that. And Yusuke has just Ice, doesn't he? Okay, what can we cover? Uh, oops, uh, stats. We can cover Electricity, Bless, Psy, Death. Fire, wind. So we can't cover ice. Okay, so I guess Yusuke makes sense to keep in there. And then it's a matter of do we care more about Psy or fire? What this? Wait, I didn't even check and did I? Oops. Um, she's got fire. That means she's also got some healing. You know what? Take Anne instead of Haru. We'll do that. I can't. Why does it allow me to select more than. Okay. Right. Uh, wait. I can just fast travel, can't I? Uh, actually, let me just quickly get back in there for a second. Yes. Uh, I want to quickly somewhere. save, of course. Let's go. All right, let's see. Wait, where? Over there. Ah, over Whoa. there. There you go. Oh, it's a UFO. Is that the frisbee skull mentioned before? That's what they're making here. 
the SS Utopia will soon enter its launch sequence from the shipbuilding dock. After retrieval of the main core, the launch sequence will commence. The SS Utopia? Project Escape to Utopia, so this is what that was about. Um. Well, Father did say he was going to ascend into the political world. So, even this company is a stepping stone for him. He will discard this place for his utopia. Wait up. If he gets out of here, we're not going to be able to make him tell us about the shutdowns. Uh. You're right. We gotta hurry. I think we can go further in now. Look. That's it. That's the treasure. What? Emergency launch sequence will soon be activated. Certain areas may be shut off or destroyed. I repeat, emergency launch sequence will soon be activated. All personnel is advised to evacuate immediately to a safe area of the facility. What in the world? There is no time to deal with this. I must be making my progress. You can all stand and watch in despair as you look down on the face. Your destruction is imminent. <laughs> There's no time. We need to hurry. Over here. Damn it. Okay, wait. There's a time limit. What the heck? This way. Why do you put in a time limit? This has to be a joke. What did you say? Hey. <laughs> Show me your true form. We'll quickly get through this, hopefully. Hey, Enough nuclear attacks won't work. Seems weak of psychokinetic moves should help Oops. here. No psychokinetic, no psychokinesis. Attack with something else. <sighs> okay. Johanna! That's one down. Go, Queen, go! Okay. okay. On to the next. Persona! There. <laughs> Why did Joker, please? What the heck is wrong with you? Prepare yourself. Let's do this. Whatever, sure. Oh, right. Doesn't really matter. Ooh, Joker. You're looking cool. Do it. And do it quick. Strong against it. Oh Jesus! Just rush. No, I don't care. Just shut up. Oh my God. Uh, why are there more? Uh, they're weak against. Sigh. Okay. Death. Uh, it doesn't matter. Just move on. I am thou. Oh, come on. Why is it? No, 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 I didn't mean to do that. Okay, good. Okay, good. Kill them quickly. Why are there even more? Are you joking? We do have the time, but Jesus. Okay. Here goes. Persona, you're mine. Two enemies floored. Not bad, Joker. Let's go. Beat him up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No one cares. Okay, I think the timer stopped with that anyway. What a skill. Sure, let's get rid of that. I've to a new power. Engage nuke resistance. That sounds good. Mm, 
to that. Okay. All right, the skirmish is over. Joker, there's a treasure chest. Oh, I didn't even you see the get door. More money. <laughs> you can get more money. Avoiding unnecessary battles would probably be for the best. Let's retreat and come up with a different strategy. No, wait, we ain't got time for that. We gotta plow through them. Are you even thinking? If you use up all of our energy now, we may as well toss our entire plan. Wait. Hold on, guys, calm down. Joker. You make the call, Joker. I've got your back either way. We're not facing them. Oh no, the worst part about this game. Maneuvering. Joker, there's a chest. Okay, we'll grab the chest. All right, good. Hey, wait up. We're taking the treasure. Looks like we caught up to you, Mr. CEO. I... I'm sorry. I've had a change of heart. I'll prove it. Father... Haru, you were always so agreeable. Whether it was in school or after, you only ever did as I said. You've become so admirable. What's gotten into him? Ah, oh, yes. Do you remember, Haru? You cried your eyes out when my work kept me from attending your first sports day. It was then that you stopped talking back to me. Honestly, you had me worried. Still, you stood up against me and became an independent young woman. Nothing could make a father happier than seeing that. You still remember something that happened so long ago? Back then, you poured your heart into making delicious food. You wanted to bring joy to others. Why did you change? Forgive me, Haru, but I would never last if my treasure was stolen. Please, don't do it. I'm begging you. Father, let's... Let's end it here. Ah, Haru. You foolish girl. 